Hey guys, thank you so much for joining in. Guys, in this particular video of WordPress series, we will understand how you can show a video inside a pop-up on your WordPress website step by step without any problem. So in order to show a pop-up and inside the pop-up, if you want to add a video, for that you have to simply perform three steps. Number one, add a plugin. Number two, set up that plugin and to add a video. And number three, to test whether the plugin is properly working. So step number one is to add a plugin. So we will go to WordPress dashboard and click on add new plugins. Here the plugin name is pop up builder and it is absolutely free of cost pop up builder and it is very useful and popular plugin when it comes to creating pop ups. And if you want to create multiple types of pop up, then you can refer my previous videos in which we have explained each and everything about the creating a pop up inside the WordPress dashboard. So from here, you will see an option called pop up builder and you need to click on install now once the installation is done you need to simply activate the plugin as well installation is done now click on activate this was our step number one now let's move to step number two that is to configure this plugin and to create a pop-up so once you activated this plugin you will see an option called pop-up builder on the left hand side click on this and you will need to create a new pop-up so click on add new once you click on add new there are options like image html facebook subscription more ideas so since you want to display video so for that just click on html option just click on html option and once you click on html option then it will ask you the title so you can give any title don't worry it will not be visible to the user it is for your reference only so we can say video auto pop-up since it will come automatically once the page is loaded and display rule everywhere it will be displayed on entire website if you want to display on only on post or maybe selected post all pages or maybe selected pages you can customize this as per your need uh, the only thing which you need to make sure is that type or choose a blog here you need to click on this plus icon if you ha don't have this editor don't worry not a problem you can choose any which way and click on video so click on video and if you have the video on your wordpress website then you can click on media library if you want to upload it click on upload or if you want to directly insert from any URL, let's say Vimeo or YouTube, then you can click on this insert from URL. We have a video here. So we'll go to our YouTube channel and we can take any YouTube video from here. And as I was saying that we have already created web videos on how to add a pop-up. So we will take that video only. So that is this one. So we'll take the link. So we'll click on share, copy this link, come back to the website, paste it here and click on this enter button and you will see the video is there once it is done click on publish and before that we have to set a rule also so event on load by default it will come and if you want to delay uh, give some delay let's say one second two second three second after the page is loaded you can do that let's say we give two second of delay and then we click on publish publish once it is done, the pop-up is published. Come back to the website. Since the rule was that once the page is loaded, after two seconds, the pop-up will show up. So here you can see the pop-up is there, but it is too, too small. So in order to increase the size, we'll come back to the settings again and click on dimensions. So here you can say it is auto right now. If you want to give minimum width or maximum width, you can do that. So let's say I want to do it, let's say 100%. I want to make it 100% and then click on uh, update as well so once it is updated come back to the website refresh the website once and now let's see how much width it has now it has this much of it you can control the width of course you can give it let's say only 50 percent of the screen size max width minimum width minimum height click on update now and come back to the website refresh the website once and now you will see it will be the 50 percent of your total screen like this now it looks good right and once someone sees this and if we clicks on this particular button the video will start playing so don't worry it you can upload the video but i will recommend to use it from a third party you know a service provider like youtube or vimeo or daily motion because if you directly host the video on your wordpress website and if it is too heavy then it may take time to get load uh, and then in that case your user might not be able to see that video in just a couple of seconds so it is always advisable that use some third party video hosting server and then embed your video so guys that's how you can create a pop-up which has your video inside the pop-up and you can show it to the users so this was a quick video on how to create a pop-up and show a video inside a pop-up i hope you liked the video and if you did you know the drill you need to 
like this video subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you never miss an update whenever we upload a new video on this channel i will see you in the next video till then take care bye bye have a nice